Have you had any further comments from the um, Conservative Party, from Richie Sunak? Has anybody apologised from that particular political party? No, no, no Conservative has apologised. Not at all. And they keep saying that uh, the Hester guy, he's apologised. He's not apologised. He's apologised for being rude, whereas in fact he was racist. And he's not apologised for that. He has apologised for being rude, and in fact he was inciting violence. He's not apologised for that. I mean, we've seen people, black men, stand trial for posting emojis. Do you think that Hester should be arrested? It's a, it's a matter for the legal system and the police. But All I'm saying is that he was inciting violence. And you believe a crime has been committed? All I'm saying is he was inciting violence. And I know people are looking at that. I feel very moved that so many people have come out at a very short notice um, and it's given me a lot of strength after what has been a very difficult week. And what do you say to those who would like you and your part of your party to no longer be part of it? I'm not going to place. I'm not going to place. You're not going anywhere? Not going anywhere. And what do you have to say to everybody who's gathered here today behind you who feel disillusioned with the Labour Party. What do you have to say to them? I'm just glad that so many people have come out to support me. It's very moving. And so what next for Diane Abbott? Well, what's next is, you know, I'm going to go home and um, I'll be in Parliament next week. That's what's next. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. So she's obviously trying to speak, but huge amounts of support there for her in her constituency.